Continuing to follow the breaking news out of Pompano Beach, Florida, where a small plane has crashed into a home. We're told the aircraft went down shortly after takeoff just before 3 p.m. Eastern. CBS News transportation correspondent Chris Van Cleve is in Washington and joins me now. Chris, what have you learned about this crash so far? Well, Vlad, we're getting some conflicting information. Our CBS affiliate in Miami, WFOR, is reporting from first responders that there are potentially three people that suffered critical injuries in this crash. We're hearing from the FAA that preliminarily there may have only been one person on board the plane and that the plane was practicing takeoff and landings when this crash happened. Based on the pictures we're seeing from the scene, the plane uh, appeared to come in contact with at least one home there that suffered uh, what appears to be fire damage on the roof. In fact, you'll see as the as this picture pulls out here where fire crews are putting water on a house and you can see the scorch damage to the roof of one of those homes there. Uh, so initial reports, uh, there are injuries here, uh, critical injuries here, uh, perhaps one person on board. We understand there weren't, uh, there's not uh, signs at this point that there were people actually home at the time of the crash. So uh, a few details to still be sorted out here, but that's not uncommon uh, as these situations are just in unfolding in front of us here. But you can see where that plane came down. It uh, appeared to impact to some extent one of those homes and then continue through the backyard into another home coming to rest there with a fence. And, you know, where, where that plane is, is destroyed there is where the, um, the passenger cabin of that aircraft would be. Uh, the plane, we can tell you, is a Beach 76. That is a dual engine four seat aircraft. Um, so it could potentially have up to four people on board. Um, it does appear to be registered out of Wyoming, but uh, planes fly around a lot. So it's not uncommon for a plane to be owned by uh, a company in a city other than where it's operating. Uh, but this is a relatively small uh, two engine propeller plane, uh, bigger than, uh, you know, like a Cessna 182, but um, you know, on that par where it would carry four passengers and came down not far from the Pompano Beach Airport, where, uh, according to the FAA, the preliminary belief is it was practicing takeoff and landings. Chris Van Cleve digging into this story. And Chris, we appreciate it because we know that the information is very fluid. Clearly, people are going to be wondering uh, not only about uh, those who may have been on board that aircraft, but certainly uh, if anybody was home. And as you report, early indications are that nobody was home, which uh, once we report fully out will be a welcome relief. Chris Van Cleve, our transportation correspondent in Washington, we thank you. Sure thing.